The Mongolic languages are a group of languages spoken in East Central Asia, mostly in Mongolia and surrounding areas plus in Kalmykia. The best known member of this language family, Mongolian, is the primary language of most of the residents of Mongolia and the Mongolian residents of Inner Mongolia, with an estimated 5.7 plus million speakers. The closest relatives of the Mongolic languages appear to be the extinct Khitan and Tuyuhun languages. Some linguists have grouped Mongolic with Turkic, Tungusic, and possibly Koreanic and Japonic as part of the controversial Altaic family. Topic. Classification Historical Mongolic Middle Mongol depending on classification spoken from the 13th century until the early 15th century or late 16th century, given the almost entire lack of written sources for the period in between, an exact cutoff point cannot be established. Classical Mongolian, from approximately 1700 to 1900 Contemporary Mongolic Door 96,000 speakers Central Mongolic Komnigan 2,000 speakers Buryat 330,000 speakers Kalka 5.2 million speakers Ordos 123,000 speakers Orat including Kalmyk 360,000 speakers Southern Mongolic part of a Gansu Qinghai Sprachbund Shira Uyghur 4,000 speakers Shirungolic Monger 150,000 speakers Bonin 6,000 speakers Santa 200,000 speakers Kongja 1,000 speakers Moghal 200 speakers Alexander Vovin 2007 identifies the extinct Tab Gamma Ak or Tuba language as a Mongolic language. However, Chen 2005 argues that Tuba Tab Gamma Ak was a Turkic language. The classification and numbers of speakers above follow Yan Hunan 2006 except for Southern Mongolic, which follows Nutteran 2011. In another classificational approach, there is a tendency to call Central Mongolian a language consisting of Mongolian proper, Orat and Buryat, while Ordos and implicitly also Komnigan is seen as a variety of Mongolian proper. Within Mongolian proper, they then draw a distinction between Khalkha on the one hand and Southern Mongolian containing everything else on the other hand. A less common subdivision of Central Mongolic is to divide it into a central dialect Kalka, Chakar, Ordos, an eastern dialect Karchin, Korchin, a western dialect Orat, Kalmyk, and a northern dialect consisting of two Buryat varieties. The broader delimitation of Mongolian may be based on mutual intelligibility, but an analysis based on a tree diagram such as the one above faces other problems because of the close contacts between, for example, Buryat and Khalkha Mongols during history, thus creating or preserving a dialect continuum. Another problem lies in the sheer comparability of terminology, as Western linguists use language and dialect, while Mongolian linguists use the Grimian trichotomy language Kelly, dialect Nutu gamma un ale gamma u and Mundart Amon ale gamma u. Pre-Proto-Mongolic Pre-Proto-Mongolic is the name for the stage of Mongolic that precedes Proto-Mongolic. Proto-Mongolic can be clearly identified chronologically with the language spoken by the Mongols during Genghis Khan's early expansion in the 1200–1210s. Pre-Proto-Mongolic by contrast is a continuum that stretches back indefinitely in time. It is divided into early Pre-Proto-Mongolic and late Pre-Proto-Mongolic. Late Pre-Proto-Mongolic refers to the Mongolic spoken a few centuries before Proto-Mongolic by the Mongols and neighboring tribes like the Merkits and Karats. Certain archaic words and features in written Mongol go back past Proto-Mongolic to late pre-Proto-Mongolic In the case of early pre-Proto-Mongolic certain loanwords in the Mongolic languages point to early contact with Ogre Bulgaric Turkic also known as R Turkic. These loanwords precede common Turkic Z Turkic loanwords and include Mongolic Ikeri twins from Bulgaric Akir versus common Turkic Akiz, Hukur ox from Bulgaric Hekur common Turkic Okus, Jer weapon from Bulgaric Jer common Turkic Yaz, Baragu calf versus common Turkic Buzagu and Siri to smelt or versus common Turkic Siz to melt. These are thought to have been borrowed from Ogre Turkic during the time of the Zongnu. Subsequent Turkic people in Mongolia all spoke forms of common Turkic, Z Turkic as opposed to Ogre Bulgaric Turkic which withdrew to the west in the 4th century. 
The Chuvash language spoken by one million people in European Russia is the only living representative of Ogre Turkic which split from Common Turkic around the 1st century CE. Words in Mongolic like Deir brown, Common Turkic Yagas and Nidurga fist, Common Turkic Udruk with initial asterisk D and asterisk N versus Common Turkic asterisk Y are sufficiently archaic to indicate loans from an earlier stage of Ogre proto since Chuvash and Common Turkic do not differ in these features despite differing fundamentally in rhoticism lambdicism Yanhunin 2006. Ogre tribes lived in the Mongolian borderlands before the 5th century and provided Ogre loanwords to early pre-Proto-Mongolic before common Turkic loanwords. <laughs> Proto-Mongolic Proto-Mongolic, the ancestor language of the modern Mongolic languages, is very close to Middle Mongol, the language spoken at the time of Genghis Khan and the Mongol Empire. Most features of modern Mongolic languages can thus be reconstructed from Middle Mongol. An exception would be the voice suffix like kaga do together, which can be reconstructed from the modern languages but is not attested in Middle Mongol. One can speculate that the languages of Donghu, Wuwan, and Shenbei might be related to Proto-Mongolic. For Tabgach, the language of the founders of the Northern Wei dynasty for which the surviving evidence is very sparse, and Khitan, for which evidence exists that is written in the two Khitan scripts which have as yet not been fully deciphered, a direct affiliation to Mongolic can now be taken to be most likely or even demonstrated. <laughs> Paramongolic The extinct Khitan language is a Paramongolic language, meaning that it is related to the Mongolic languages as a sister group, rather than as a direct descendant of Proto-Mongolic. Alexander Vovin 2015 identifies the extinct Tuyuhun language as yet another Paramongolic language. <laughs> Notes <laughs> References Vovin, Alexander, 2007. Once again on the Tabgic language. Mongolian Studies 29, 191-206. External links Ethnic map of Mongolia Monumenta Altaica grammars, texts, dictionaries and bibliographies of Mongolian and other Altaic languages.